After announcing to the world he stands with local farmers, President Trump is making good on his promise to bail out American ag workers. That's our top story this morning. Despite some last minute uncertainty, the USDA has officially approved a second round of aid payments to the tune of $4.7 billion. That's in addition to the nearly $5 billion payout issued earlier this fall. This bailout, as it's being called, is intended to make up for lost farm earnings due to an ongoing trade war with China, a feud that has crippled the market for soybeans, corn, and several other commodities that make up a large part of the Siouxland ag industry. Tough in the short run, and has hit this district more than any other district in the entire United States. We knew that from the beginning. Most of our producers out there, our soybean producers and our pork producers in particular, they're hanging on with this and saying, we can march through this, we're going to be okay. Iowa Representative Steve King went on to say this second aid package will bring a big boost to many local farmers. Unsurprisingly, the bulk of that $4.7 billion payout is focused on soybeans, with the Ag Department suggesting farmers will receive an additional $1.65 per bushel. Not much relief for corn producers, though, who will only see their price per bushel raised by a penny. Pork producers will see the next largest payment at $8 a head. No word yet on when farmers can expect to see those checks.